we're here at uh, GNU Radio Conference. I'm Hayden Nelson. I was going to give you a little tour of our demo table here in the Expo Hall. We have got a lot of radios on here, so let's take a look at what we brought here to uh, Washington, D.C. So, so here is the, uh, um, you know, no, we know it, we love it, the uh, USRP N320, uh, two of them, sampling at 250 mega samples per second, doing FFT processing on the FPGA, and trans. trans that to the host and we're uh, doing four data streams looking at you know real-time spectrum monitoring here with uh, USRP. So as you come down the table here to the right um, you can see we have a USRP E320. This is one of our embedded series radios. We have a 3db lab scepter software here. We're doing kind of some signals intelligent software. You'll notice we have an exact same instance of the same program running right here uh, within this LCR embedded VPX chassis. We have the Curtis Wright VPX3 E320. Now this is a direct port of the USRP E320 from Edis Research onto SOSA Align, CMOS, and Mora um, 3U VPX, the VPX3 E320. So you can kind of see here, I, I have this little ham radio and we can see that I can go, hey, K5, Golf, November Uniform. And as we look here at the 3D Lab Scepter software, you can see that signal showing up here in the, in the spectrum. Same thing here on the VPX3 E320. They're, they're tuned to slightly different frequencies here, but you can see that they're working. They're both using UHD. Um, and so you can port your software-defined radio application from a you know embedded series Edis Research USRP to VPX literally in a matter of minutes. Our first customer did this in about 10 minutes, which is pretty impressive. And it's, it's nice because you can get to a deployable form factor really quickly. Next, we have MathWorks here with us today. MathWorks has a, uh, an, uh, using a, a USRP N320 um, with their communication toolbox um, within, within MathWorks and doing some Wi-Fi 6 um, work on the FPGA here. And, 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 you know, moving down to our, our next demo, like I said, we got a lot of radios on this table. We have our open architecture for radar and EW research. Now, this is a four-channel version, and as you can see, we have four phase-coherent channels. We're sharing all the local oscillators here. Um, we have four, two USRP N320s, an N320 and an N321. Um, we're using GNU Radio here to do a direction-finding application here. And so you can kind of see, um, if I take my transmit antenna, I'm able to detect the angle of this based on the, the coherent phase difference between these different channels. And lastly, here on the table, we have our um, you know, hot rod of the, uh, the USRP world, which is the USRP, um, the NI Edis USRP X410, if you will, um, which is a four channel, 400 megahertz per channel transmit and receive, um, kind of our highest end, highest performance USRP. And here we're actually using RF knock in the FPGA to do a similar application that we saw down there, but we're processing a lot more spectrum because this, this radio is a lot wider bandwidth. And on top of it here is a brand new product that was just um, announced and released from SignalCraft, which is a 5G new radio signal conditioning module. Now this adds uh, the ability to get bandpass filters, LNAs, PAs to, um, you know, be compliant with the signal requirements of a 5G new radio network. You know, so to learn more about uh, all of the various different radios you see here today, go to um, ni.com slash SDR or go to edis.com. I appreciate your time.